What's up? It's me, Mr. Bradley, and today we're learning about the moon. But before we begin, hit that subscribe button and get ready to do the starter questions on your screen right now. We made it. The moon. I'm ready to start exploring this dusty rock. I have my space suit, my space helmet. The only thing missing are my space boots. I was forgetting something. The moon has been the Earth's constant companion, circling it for millions of years before life had even begun. Since human beings could think, we've always looked at the... Why am I finding up when I'm on the moon? Since human beings could think, we've always looked at the moon in amazement and wonder. It controls the ocean's tides. We've based our calendars off of it. But what actually is it? The moon is a grey, dusty ball of rock that can easily be seen from Earth on clear nights. Although we can only see one moon from Earth, there are actually more than 200 moons in our solar system. Jupiter alone has 80 moons surrounding it. Which I think is just being greedy. Wow. Nobody found that one funny. The diameter of the moon, the distance through it, is 3,476 kilometers. That's roughly a quarter of the size of Earth. The moon is also more than 348,000 kilometers away from the Earth. The same distance away as 30 Earth. Thanks for calling Domino's. Today's special is two Thanks large for calling pizzas. Domino's. Thanks for calling Today's Domino's. Today's Domino's. Today's up here. Although the moon is massive, it's not considered a planet because it orbits our Earth instead of the sun. Instead, we call the moon a satellite. The moon rotates around the Earth, but it doesn't do this in a perfect circle. It does this in something called an ellipsis shape, which is pretty much an egg shape. It also spins at the same speed that it rotates around the Earth, which means that we will always see the same side of the moon from Earth. It takes 27.3 days for the moon to rotate around the Earth. Humans noticed this thousands of years ago and have used the moon ever since to keep a track of time. Many moons ago. Which is where the word month came from, the time it takes for the moon to rotate around the Earth. Although the moon appears to be glowing in the night sky, it doesn't actually make its own light. Instead, it reflects the sun's light, kind of like a giant mirror. Sorry, I've been told before that people don't understand when I say the word mirror with my accent. So what I really mean is like a giant mirror. This is proved by the changing shapes of the moon as it waxes and wanes from a crescent moon to a full moon to no moon at all. What's really happening here is the earth is getting in the way of the light of the sun, blocking out that sunlight and changing the shape of the moon. Move, get out the way. We call this the phases of the moon. I know what you're thinking, what's it all made of? Facts, it cheese. The moon's surface is covered in dead volcanoes, impact craters, and lava flows. Craters caused by asteroids can be seen everywhere on the moon. This is because unlike Earth, the craters that are formed by asteroids are never wiped clean or destroyed by erosion or moving tectonic plates, which doesn't exist on the moon. So craters from millions of years ago can always be seen on the moon because they're never wiped clean. The moon even has oceans. Well, kind of. In these so-called oceans, there is no water, but instead, 
there's miles and miles of hardened lava which once was molten millions of years ago but since then this lava has cooled down and hardened For most of human history, the moon could only be studied from far away. That is until the 20th of July, 1969, when humans stood on the moon for the first time ever, thanks to the American space flight mission, Apollo 11. Neil Armstrong, Buzz Aldrin both took a step on the moon while Michael Collins manned the spacecraft. There are over 200 moons in our solar system. The moon is roughly a quarter of the size of Earth and orbits the Earth in an ellipsis shape. The moon does not make its own light and instead reflects the sun's light. The moon's surface is covered in craters, dead volcanoes and lava flows. Well, that's the end of the video folks. Hope you enjoyed it. We're losing daylight here on the moon. Stay tuned for more space videos. Make sure that you don't miss out on Mars. And as always, thanks for watching. See you next time. Wait a minute. My helmet. And don't forget to subscribe. See you next time. <laughs> <laughs>